Welcome to our channel. Today we are going to explain how an electric iron works. If you are new here and do not forget to subscribe for more videos about cool tech stuff. So an electric iron has a few key parts inside. So let's see what are those. The first is heating element. The second is thermostat and the thermal fuse and the neon bulb. The heating element is the main part that gets hot. It is made of special metal called nichrome which can handle very high temperature. When you plug in the iron, electricity flows through this metal and it heats up. We have a layer of magnesium oxide powder which keeps the heating element from touching the metal case of the iron which keeps the thing safe. As the metal uh, or the heating element gets hot, it is important to control the temperature that is where the thermostats comes in. It checks the temperature of the iron's metal place and turns up the heat if it gets too hot. The thermostat has input and output terminal, a contact strip, a bimetallic strip. The bimetallic strip is made of two different metals. When heated, the metal expands at different rates. For example, copper expands more than steel. If you heat this metal together, the metal strip bends towards the metal that expands less. In this case, it is steel. This bending helps the thermostat turn the heat on and off. So, when the iron gets too hot, the bimetallic strip bend. So let's see how it works. You can see the bending and now uh, I'll demonstrate you how it is used here. So when the iron gets too hot, the bimetallic strip bends and pulls the contact spring which stops the electricity from flowing. When the iron cools down, the strip goes back to its original shape and allowing the electricity to flow again. There is also a formal fuse for safety feature. If the thermostat fails and the iron gets too hot, the thermal fuse will cut off the power to prevent a fire. So here it is the thermal fuse that you are seeing. So now I will show you how everything is connected. The phase wire is connected to the thermostat input. The neutral wire is connected to the heating element. The thermal fuse is connected to the thermostat and the heating element. The neon bulb shows the heating element is on and the earth wire is connected to the iron's body for safety. So when you turn on the iron and set it to a high temperature, electricity flows to the heating element without stopping. When it gets too hot, it is over 200 degrees centigrade, the thermo thermostat turns off the heat. When it cools down below 1500, uh, 150 degrees centigrade, the thermostat turns the heat back. If you set the iron to a lower temperature, it heats up very slowly. The thermal fuse protects the iron by stopping the power if something goes wrong. So we hope that this video helps you understand how an electric iron works.